What's up everybody? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those of you who are new in, I'm Siam and in my today's review I will compare two high-end class woman bags. And the products I'm talking about is the monogram chain wallet of Yves Saint Laurent, which looks like this here. Check it out. So, so fancy and elegant girls. And I will compare this cutie today and now already I say sorry for the wrong pronunciation. I will compare it with the Raven um, chain wallet of Louis Vuitton, which looks like this. Isn't it cute, girls? It's so lovely. And I just recognized that doing the video or on the video, the colors look the same. But this is actually not the fact. This is like a dark beige and this is like a... They call it like Tatarelle Grey or whatever. But I think it's like a darker beige than this one. So this is like a little bit a lighter beige than this one. However, on the video, we can't really see the difference. That's the reason why I just want to mention it. The color is definitely different. However, I will compare these two cuties together today. I will show you how the bags looks like in the inside as well, so that you can maybe buy, make an easier buying decision if you're interested in one of these products. And I'm really, really looking forward to this review. And I can always say that the one from Yves Saint Laurent is a little bit um, taller and bigger than the one from Louis Vuitton. Uh, so that's maybe just as a side information before we will start now with the review. And now I will start with Yves Saint Laurent to give you a little bit more details regarding this bag. All right, then let's have a look on this cutie bag here, basically. So this is the design of the bag. As you can see, it looks like this. You have 100% calfskin leather, which you can definitely smell if you get this bag here. In the middle, you have this nice brand logo here in metal, and it's in gold. Like, it looks super elegant and expensive and exclusive, basically. And the dimensions of this bag is basically 22.5 times 14 times 4 centimeter. And now let's have a look on the inside of the bag, basically. I hope you can see it kind of. So you have here two different compartments basically which are separated. So you have in the middle here a zip pouch basically. Voila. Zip pouch basically where you can put like some coins or some money or whatever in it. And then you have here as well um, 10 card slots where you can put your credit card, your driver license or whatever. And then you have this metal chain in gold as well, which is super, super nice and exclusive as well. And the, the length is 48 centimeter basically. So if you can see it like this. And uh, what fits basically in the back so you can try it out. I have like here a regular rouge, which I can put here. And then I have my lipstick as well. And then your keys. Okay, my keys are a little bit thicker. However, this can be put as well inside here. Let's grab it like this. And then you see already the bag is full. Uh, you can remove this lovely chain. So you would have like a clutch for the evening. Um, but as well for the day, you can remove it. And then you have a regular nice clutch which looks, which looks super, super Elegant. And it is made on in Italy, of course. So this is the one from Yves Saint Laurent, a really lovely and nice bag. Price is 1,100 euro. Now we will have a closer look on the lovely Louis Vuitton bag. So let's check it out together. And so the price of this bag is 1,400 euro, so a little bit more expensive than the one from Yves Saint Laurent. And you can see that this color, they call it like turtle gray. However, I think it's like a kind of dark dark uh, beige, which is as well really, really lovely in combination with this gold um, details here. As you can see, the bag is like basically printed with the signature of Louis Vuitton everywhere, which makes the bag, of course, looks more high class and really, really elegant as well. And I think it's not too much because it's like kind of, um, hidden so you don't immediately see everywhere the sign. dimensions of this bag is 19 times 12.5 times 4 centimeter then it has like a embossed cohide leather here and have like a collar color hardware in the middle which makes it a little bit more exclusive and just like super expensive this bag and now if we open the bag as well you have here two um, 
suggested compartments here. So and in the middle you have again a flat zipped coin pocket here where you can put some coins. Then you have here the possibility to put your phone which is quite cool. And here you have again like six um, card holders or slots where you can put your credit card, your uh, visa card or whatever. And as well here, let's check what it fits in. So I have again my rouge, which I will put here. Remove the chain, first of all. Then I have my lipstick as well. And my keys. Okay, super big. And this fits perfectly fine in this bag as well. It has like a long golden chain here. So it's a little bit longer than the one from Yves Saint Laurent because it's like 53 um, uh, centimeter. As you can see as well in the video, it's a little bit, it's falling longer than the one from Yves Saint Laurent. Mm, but as well, really, really cool. And you can combine the bag definitely with many stylish outfits and you can wear it as well as a clutch. It's basically the lovely Louis Vuitton bag, which is as well a really, really cute and nice bag. So girls, this was basically all regarding the features of these two bags. Definitely both of, of them are super cute and super lovely and like, yeah, they're of course super, super elegant. Um, so I hope that my review was yeah, supportive for you and that you, were, that you are now able to decide what bag you would prefer to buy. I want to make one point just again clear maybe. If you buy these products in general, you don't pay for the uh, material or for the good quality. At the end, you pay for the brand as with any other brands out there. So for example, with the Apple iPhone as well, you don't pay for the phone, you pay for the Apple 1,600 euro. And it's exactly the same as with the brands here, especially if you're saving your salary every month for this bag, just keep in mind whether it's really worth it to buy this product. You really need it. It's another question which everybody should ask herself because, uh, before buying such products. That was my personal opinion, girls. Nonetheless, I hope you enjoyed the review. Feel free to share this review with all your friends and family members who are interested in luxury products, of course. I would really love to see you next time again on my channel. Have all a wonderful day. See you soon and bye-bye.